Good afternoon, and welcome to the Crypto Podcast with your host, the average crypto guy, Deuce Lee. And today, we're going to talk about Tectonic. And this paper was built on November 19th, built, published on November 19th. I guess I could just read through this thing like an audiobook. What do you say? You can just push play and drive or take a walk, take a jog, pump some iron, get smarter. You know what I'm saying? So let's go down here. It's called Tectonic. Here's the light paper. And let's read the summary. And this was published again on November 19th. It is now December 9th. So in summary, Tectonic is coming. If you are part of the Tectonian soon army lurking on our telegram since the early days, We thank you for your loyalty, and we assure you that you are in your final days of trending soon. If this is your first time reading about us, you may be wondering what Tectonic is about. Let's dive right in. At the heart of Tectonic, it is a cross-chain algorithmic money market built on the Kronos blockchain. Tectonic allows users to lend and borrow crypto assets with corresponding interest rates that are determined algorithmically based on the supply and demand of those assets. Tectonic is incubated by Particle B, the premier startup accelerator dedicated to incubating projects built on the Kronos and Crypto.org chain. Excuse me. How Tectonic Works Understanding how Tectonic works is critical so as to safely interact with the protocol. Tectonic protocols design and architecture references Compound. Compound is one of the largest DeFi money market protocols on Ethereum. Tectonic aims to facilitate the permissionless redistribution of interest payments from borrowers to lenders, where users may lend and borrow different assets with variable interest rates algorithmically adjusted based on the utilization of the lending pool. Does this sound familiar? Kind of like what VVS kind of does, if I'm not mistaken, right? Are we all on the same page here? Listen, I don't know shit about DAOs or anything like that. I'm just putting two and two together, and it sounds like this is like another VVS going on right here, right? Use cases for Tectonic. Hodlers generate additional returns from interest by supplying assets to the protocol, 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 whatever, without having to actively manage their assets. So there's auto staking, I guess, which is what they're talking about. Leverage traders, okay, borrow certain cryptocurrencies to capitalize their short-term trading view, for example, shorting, or maximize yield opportunities by farming. Okay, same shit as uh, VVS. Borrowers obtain easy access to cryptocurrencies for multiple other purposes. Participate in IDOs, bonding, etc. Without having to liquidate their original assets. Interesting. Are they saying you don't have to move your money? We're just going to like hook you up with these things because you're already like you already own assets with us you know in the pool kind of like vvs maybe roman numeral number three core modules with tectonic interest rate mechanism we have adapted a variable interest rate model popular with other DeFi money market protocols in the market such as compound and ave where users may lend and borrow assets offered on tectonic with rates that are determined by the supply and demand of the asset these rates are algorithmically determined based on utilization rate of the respective lending pools furthermore the computation of the interest rates is separated into two stages before utilization reaches kink level oh yeah kink level the interest rate is a linear interpolation of the utilization rate (sighs) the interest rate is a linear interpolation of the utilization of the metropolitan of the synchronization of the civilization of the irritableization station and get the f- the interest rate is a linear interpolation can we can we do something about that hold on interpolation 
Jesus Christ. Interpolation, the insertion of something of a different nature into something else. God, that even that is like a mind. A remark interjected in a conversation. As the evening progressed, their interpolations become more ridiculous. <laughs> Sounds like me and my ex. Fucking bitch. All right, anyway, the insertion of something of a different nature into something else. The interpolation of songs into the piece. God, this word sucks. The interest rate is a linear interpolation of the utilization rate. That's just a dumb fucking sentence. During periods of high utilization, which exceeds the kink level, the slope of on which the respective interest rate increases becomes steeper, reflecting the urgency to attract more lenders and to disincentivize the borrowers. Interest rates and other lending parameters are set by the tectonic team at genesis of the protocol. So genesis is like, <laughs> these guys are using biblical terms. Guys, seriously, the genesis, but would be subjected to change based on tectonics community voting once the tectonic governance process is established. Furthermore, the computation of interest rates is separated into two stages. Before utilization reaches kink level, the interest rate is a linear interpolation of the utilization rate. That's just a fucking dumb sentence. During periods of high utilization which exceeds the kink level, the slope on which the respective interest rate increases becomes steeper, reflecting the urgency to attract more lenders and to disincentivize the borrowers. I think this is my second or third time reading this paragraph. If anybody knows what the f they're talking about, please, in l plain English, for lack of a better understanding by me, can you tell me in s simple English? Interest rates and other lending parameters are set by the tectonic team at genesis of the protocol Dog, these, who wrote this interest rates and other lending parameters are set by the tectonic team at genesis of the protocol but would be subjected to change based on tectonics community voting once the tectonic governance process is established and that could take a while vvs we haven't even gone to a voting phase yet you know what i mean we're still young so this is months down the line, probably, when they do get on board. Okay, liquidation model. The liquidation model is a core component of the tectonic to prevent bad debts from borrowers and to guarantee the deposit supplied by lenders. Borrowing positions that exceed the predetermined borrowing limit of their collateral will be eligible for liquidations. Tectonic offers a liquidation discount to incentivize liquidators to liquidate loans when any outstanding loan exceeds its borrowing capacity and to motivate borrowers to be mindful of their leverage. Interesting. Due to the possibility of a lack of liquidators at Genesis, Tectonic core team will take part in facilitating the liquidation events to prevent prolonged unhealthy accounts. Once there is a sufficient and constant supply of liquidators, a governance vote will be established to remove tectonic core team as one of the liquidators. Interesting. And then that's when we pretty much take over the voters. I'm saying we like I'm going to be one. We'll see. Community insurance module. Please note that the community insurance module, staking and locking, is projected to only go live in Q1 2022. Ooh, so that's what these guys are waiting for. Staking and locking. Tonic holders will be able to contribute to the safety of the protocol by staking their tokens within Tectonic's community insurance module. The purpose of this module is to act as a mitigation tool in case of any shortfall event. Users who stake Tonic tokens will receive ST tonic in return, which represents a tokenized position of their stake, staked positions. ST means stake tonic in return. However, 
may be subject to slashing up to a certain proportion in the case of a shortfall event. Interesting. So are they saying when we're staked and there's like a shortfall, we go up if you're staked? Let's read on. Shortfall events may include the following occurrences and will be further defined by tectonic governance. More information on the various types of shortfall events, etc. I mean, for example, smart contract risk, liquidation risk, oracle failure risk can be found in our white paper and documentations. Okay. Additionally, stakers will have the option to lock their staked positions for a minimum of 90 days. On top of accruing staking yields, locked positions will accrue a portion of the fees gathered from the tectonic protocol. Just like VVS is what I'm hearing. This is another VVS, okay? So if you want to get in, this could be an early opportunity is pretty much what's going on, I guess. Tectonic's native token is Tonic, which will function as a governance token for Tectonic. The Tectonic core team will take charge to manage the protocol at the beginning and over time will transition governance over to the community slash stakeholders. We will be releasing further information on tonic supply distribution and release schedule nearer to the launch date. On the topic of bootstrapping growth, while we will be using liquidity mining incentives to bootstrap Tectonic's initial growth, we are firm believers of owning our own protocol liquidity in the long run in order to drive sustainable liquidity growth. And I believe that I believe that is good in the beginning to manipulate the market for healthy structure, to, to provide stability. You know what I mean? And I believe in that. And then from there, you can hand the baton off and we can do true governance for the people by the people. Okay. Those are just my thoughts, my opinion, my, uh, you know, that's how I process everything right here. I could be wrong, though. Don't fucking listen to me. I'm not your financial advisor. I don't know shit about crypto, okay? I'm just making this video because I can. We are in for the long haul, and in order to align long-term incentives be between tonic stakers with the protocol, stakers that stake and lock their tonic with the community insurance module will accrue a portion of the fees earned by the protocol and will automatically see the value of this of the stake tonic increase so when you stake tonic you're going to get the most value out of it